I have an L3 pre-order haul for you today. I am so excited. This arrived yesterday and I just haven't had a chance to bust into the package, but it smelled amazing before I even opened the two layers of bubble wrap envelopes. So we know this is going to be good. All right, we will start with my freebies and then we will get into it. All right, we got a banana Laffy Taffy. Honestly, probably my favorite flavor of Laffy Taffy. Not set. Freebies. We got three Blizzard Breezes in a heart shape. Oh, that's got a minty. That's nice. Nice and refreshing. Mint heavy scent. Um, I want to say not wintergreen. It reminds me of gum. The like Arctic type mint gums. It's kind of what it smells like. At least to me. Next we have what looks kind of like a donut. A little donut um, in white woods. It's a nice... I'll have to look that one up. I'm not sure what that smells like. I like it, um, but I will need to see the, would need to see scent notes to be able to say what that smells like. But it had a, I wanted to say outdoors and vanilla at the same time. White woods. I, I mean, I guess it kind of makes sense. And then we've got Ice Princess, which is just like a fun little shape here. Another mint. I like the Blizzard Breeze better, but this will be another nice one to have in the bathroom. It's where you do, do most of my samples, um, just because that room gets the smelliest, if you know what I mean. So the pre-order was, I got two cents. I wanna say there was four total that they did pre-orders for um, samplers. I got crumb cake and coffee. If you've watched any of my wax hauls, you should know that coffee is my jam. So, um, I'm going to start with the crumb cake because I know I'm going to like the coffee, but these are samplers from L3. They were $20 and I got $20 each plus shipping. And then what it is in this fun little organza bag. This, organza. this one's neat and has like roses all over it. Um, but inside each bag is eight of these little round they kind of remind me of little mini angel food cakes I, she has a name for these and it's escaping me but uh, so we are just going to get started on these crumb cakes so all of these have crumb cake every single one it's what's with it. So, ooh, blackberry jam crumb cake. You don't get to know in the pre-order, at least I don't remember seeing what the, or maybe I did. I've just forgotten because it's been about four weeks. Oh guys, blackberry jam crumb cake. That's delicious. Um, What I was saying was I can't remember if I knew the eight paired scents um, at time I ordered or if they were surprised. At this point, they're a surprise because my order note doesn't say it, <laughs> but the the listing may have. Um, but blackberry jam crumb cake. I'm already liking that one. This one is fun ready pink color. Crumb cake, funnel cake, fresh fruit slices. Ooh, I get the fruit. I'd hope the... Well, there's the funnel cake. Kind of comes in at the end. I was thinking with crumb cake and funnel cake, it was going to smell more like a, you know, a summer fair or something. But I, I do get the, the sweet fruit note um, first. So I'm going to be curious to see how that one goes on warm. It's enjoyable. Probably not something I'd order myself. This one is pink frosted animal cookies with crumb cake, obviously. It's a nice pretty pink, kind of like what you'd see on an animal cookie. It's 
smells just like you think it would. The crumb cake has a nice buttery note that just elevates that, the frosted cookie element that um, I'm sure the pink frosted animal cookies has. Okay. Uh, crumb cake, pizzelle, and lemon pound cake. Ooh, I'm not normally a lemon. Let me try that again. I don't like the taste of lemon, but I don't mind the smell of lemon. This seems like it would smell good. Not 100% sure what a pizzelle is. It's so lemony. Lemony crumb cake pound. Mm. That's going to be nice. It's a nice mellow lemon. You you know it's there, but it's not in your face lemon and it's got on the sweeter side because of the, the cakey elements. I'm excited about that. All right. Next I have crumb cake cotton candy frosting cheesecake. Intriguing. If this melts half as good as this smells, I'll have to buy more of this. I think my husband will like this one. It's a nice sweet. The cheesecake mellows out the sweet, so it's not like sugar sweet, but just sweet bakery. Very, very nice. Mexican fried ice cream crumb cake. Yeah, the, the buttery of the crumb cake mixed with that fried ice cream is going to be so amazing, um, especially on warm. When you get that fried element back, the, the warm part of the fried element back, that's going to be good. <clears throat> Ooh, pretzel crumb cake sea salt caramel. I love me a pretzel. And the pretzels at the front. I'm sure this sea salt caramel is too, is there too, but I like I, I like that the pretzel kind of hit my nose first. I'm a happy girl. All right, last of the crumb cakes, pina colada crumb cake mallow fluff. The color is a bit interesting on this one, but that's all right. Who cares, right? It's pina colada in a bag. That is, you get, but, but with that crumb cake there to round it out. Oh yeah, that's gonna be good. So those are my crumb cakes. I am excited about the majority of those. I didn't expect to love all of them, but ooh, yeah, yeah, those are, those are going to be fun. The drawstrings on this bag are a little flimsy. All right, moving on to the coffee. This is the one that hopped in my cart first. We'll, we'll just be straight with you. I saw a coffee sampler and jumped on it. There we go. Can I tie it? Um, again, eight cents. I don't remember if they were a part of the listing in the beginning from when I ordered it or not, but here we go. Snickers coffee zucchini bread whipped cream is a fun little purple color. I'm not, all I smell is the zucchini bread. I'm not upset by this, but I'm not smelling the description. Maybe it needs more time to cure. I'll report back. Irish cream mocha chip latte with a dash of cinnamon sugar. It's that time of year for that, Irish cream, March. Okay, that, that's better. That, that's that got a better scent to it. Definitely get the mocha chip. Might, I might, I might be getting the cinnamon. Yeah, that one, that one 
that the redeeming, redeeming itself here. Um, I'm not 100% sure I'm going to love that just because I'm not a huge Irish cream person. But that mocha chip is a nice scent. Okay, next we have orange chiffon cake, orange vanilla coffee, and sugar cookie royale. Definitely orange. <laughs> Not getting any coffee on this one. There's too much bakery in there overpowering it, I think. So I'll be curious to see if that comes out on warm, but it does smell good. All right. Next we have roasted coffee, blueberry buttermint, zucchini bread. Sounds like a good bit. I'm getting the buttermint. Coffee's there, but it's subtle. The buttermint is definitely getting mellowed out by the zucchini bread. Okay, I'm more excited about my crumb cake sampler. I'm gonna be honest here. I still have half the coffee one to go though, so we'll see. Um, so this one is called Today is October 3rd Toasted Coffee. And then with a note down here, it says Palo Santo Sugar Cookie Royale and Toasted Malo. Um, so this is a blend of blends, I think. <laughs> um, this one smells nice, but very subtle on the coffee. I think I'll like it though. The Sugar Cookie Royale with, uh, with that coffee with the toasted coffee is, is nice. Yep. Yep, yep, yep. Next we have Naughty Nutcracker Maple Sugar Coffee Bean. That's a mouthful. Naughty Nutcracker Maple Sugar Coffee Bean, which says roasted chestnuts, sweet maple coffee, and vanilla. So. Another one that's not very strong in the bag. I think it'll do okay on warm. We'll see. I tend to melt coffee scents here in this room that's smaller. I get I get a sweetness and the and a subtle vanilla, but it's this is a very faint scent. I have a feeling I'm gonna let these cure for. Uh, at least a couple more weeks. I I still have so far to go on my wax I pulled for this, the last video I did that had a melting basket. Um, I've barely made a dent, so these are going to have plenty of time to cure. Cafe Sea Hazelnut Coffee Mate White Chocolate Raspberry Truffle. That, that, another mouthful. Cafe Sea Hazelnut Coffee Mate White Chocolate Raspberry Truffle. really fun pink color. Yeah, another, I'm getting the raspberry truffle, I think. Why did my nose just stopped working? L3 normally has some pretty strong scent, so I can't, I don't know why I could smell earlier. It's nice. It's again, subtle. I have a feeling these just need longer to cure. I'm, I'm not sure how long they sit on those on these pre-orders before they send them out so that's hopefully all it is last but not least roasted coffee amaretto vanilla bean noel this i've had all of these since and something else not together i like them all let's see if i like them together what do we think Okay, there's some, there's some scent. I'm getting the vanilla, or yeah, the vanilla. Amaretto is what I was going to say. The coffee's not there, at least on sniff, uh, cold sniff. So I'll be curious to see, like I said, these coffee ones, we're going to have to see what they do on warm. Um, they are not 
very coffee heavy and on cold but again I with this being a pre-order it's entirely possible they just need that time to cure just a couple weeks um I have mostly good luck with throw and scent when it comes to L3 from what I've melted so far um I'm not too overly concerned and if I don't like a scent I won't buy it again uh for $20 to get eight of these it's not a bad deal really so what would that even break down to eight times two is 16 so like two and a half dollars for for one if one doesn't smell good oh darn you know so um like I said not not a huge deal if some of these don't end up being my favorites but I did like a lot of those crumb cake ones and some of these coffee ones have potential I think they just need to sit and marinate a little bit longer um like I said when those I could smell these granted it was a hodgepodge of scents coming through two bubble mailers in their bags so I know the scents are there it's just a matter of getting them to come out on warm so I look forward to mel melting all this the crumb cake bag definitely probably gonna happen sooner than the coffee but um the coffee combinations sound good they they sound promising and we'll just see what they do in a couple weeks let's face it a couple months by the time I get around to this I need to melt some older wax first but that's it for today. Thank you for watching my wax haul. Sorry for the crazy eyebrows. I just did not want to sit on this any longer. In the, because I do believe they have extras available. So if you liked what you heard or are curious yourself for a pretty good deal, I will link L3 down below. Thank you so much for watching. If you like this video, please give it a like. Subscribe if you want to see more content like this. And I will see you again next time.